But if I were to tell you that you were going to be more happy, more successful, more positive, like just feel better, have a better life if you were to do something, wouldn't you try it? Because I know I would. Hey guys, it's Natalie and today I'm going to be doing a different video. I wasn't really planning on doing this video, but here we are. I don't know. We're just going to go for it. So lately I've been thinking a lot about well, how I think about things, if that makes sense. And I've been realizing that I could be a more positive person. We all have things that we can work on, so this is just one of mine. That's the great thing about being human, we're not all perfect, unless you're like Jennifer Aniston. <laughs> to get more in detail about this, basically whenever someone says something bad that happened to them, I'm always that friend that's like, oh, that sounds like something that would happen to me, or if something bad happens to me, I'm like, oh, I have the worst luck, or just my luck, or what else? Oh my gosh, just my luck, that's like such a good movie with Lindsay Lohan, and who's the guy in that? Oh my gosh, he's like so cute. He's in um, he's in Princess Diaries, The Royal Engagement. What's his name? Let me look it up. Sorry, right. side note. Ah, Chris Pine. I think what I was saying was that I'm just the person that's like, oh my gosh, crap happens to you. Crap happens to me all the time. It's like one of my things. I'm a realist. I'm like, based off of experience, I have bad luck. So I'm gonna say I have bad luck. And there's nothing wrong with being a realist, but sometimes realists should be a little bit more positive, which is what I'm analyzing about myself and realizing. And when I say those things, like I have bad luck or that that sounds like something that would happen to me, I genuinely believe that. Like I believe that that's true. But on the other hand, I know people who are carefree, positive, everyone loves to be around them, they have such a good vibe and they don't say things like that and it almost seems like nothing bad ever happens to them and they're the type of people that like win the lottery. However though, I will say that that's an outsider perspective, like I don't know everything that goes on in those people's life, so that analyzation cannot be true but that's just how it seems from like a random realist out there. But if I were to tell you that you were going to be more happy, more successful, more positive, like just feel better, have a better life if you were to do something, wouldn't you try it? Because I know I would. So I think you know where I'm going with this, like positive affirmations, law of attraction, manifesting, the whole shebang. I'm not saying if you do these things that you're gonna have a better life and you're gonna win the lottery, everything's gonna fall into place. I'm just sort of at the point where it's like, I've been doing this saying like, I have bad luck and then I continue to have bad luck. So why not try something different? You know what I mean? I'm just kind of at the point where it's like, Let's change the playbook. Let's try something new. Get a new, what do you say in like football? I'm a theater kid, I don't know, whatever. So as I said, I'm not saying that any of those things are gonna happen for you, but maybe they would. I don't know, I've never tried this. If there's the slightest chance of any of those things happening for you, wouldn't you try it, like at least for a bit? Again, kind of at the point where I'm at, I wanna try something different. So as a tool to help me on this journey, I bought this journal and it's cool because it has the dates at the top. Oh my God, it's not focused for that. So I guess you're just gonna have to believe me. This is just like sort of like a way to like refocus yourself and focus on the things that you want in your life or writing down positive affirmations so that you actually believe it at some point in your life. I don't know. I mean, there's so much about the human brain and just everything that we don't know about. So if there's, again, slightest chance of this working, why not try it? I think it's good to have like your thoughts written down. I've never like wrote like a diary really or anything and I sort of wish I did so this can be something cool for me to look back on. There are people out there that say like what you put out in the world is sort of like what you give in the world so or get in the world right that's what they say. So if I'm putting out negative negativity. So if I'm putting out negativity, maybe I'm getting negativity back. I don't know. I've never been a person to like really think too hard on that, but I'm thinking on it clearly because I'm making this video. So let's think about it together, shall we? I think what I'm going to do is like write down like my top manifestations or do you say that manifestations? Top things I'm manifesting or the top positive affirmations I need to focus on for myself right now. And then kind of like go into detail, maybe not about each one of them, but like pick one for each day about like why I want that for myself or like why I think I need that or what it'll do for me if I can like achieve that or like feel that way. So I don't know. I think it's a really good idea and I'm excited about it and I'm trying to get other people into it like my boyfriend and my siblings and my parents and their friends. <laughs> and speaking of friends and family, I think it's important to tell your friends and family about this if you do decide to do it like me because this is like a new thing for me and I'm probably gonna slip up and like say those things like, eh, just my luck that I 
fell into a ditch. I don't, okay, that's dramatic. Like you need those people around you to tell you that like, hey, you're doing this thing and we're not gonna do that anymore. So they can kind of keep you back on track. Just sort of like get you back on your roadmap or remind you, you know what I mean? I really want to like follow up and like half a year or like four months, something like that, and see like if I'm noticing a positive trend, we're on a good jive, we're in a good groove, I don't know. Again, if there's anything that I can do to live my best life, I'm gonna do it. So we're gonna journal for however long I decide to and see how it goes. I kinda think that that's all that I wanted to say. I don't know, I don't know, I'm excited about it. So if you do it, definitely leave a comment down below or if you get into it, try to encourage your friends to, maybe buy them a journal for the birthday, whatever you wanna do. And that's all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it's different, but it'd be awesome if you could comment, subscribe, like the video, do all that stuff. I'd really appreciate it and I'll see you in my next one. Thanks for watching, bye guys.